What's up, everybody? <laughs> Welcome to the Quadcast. My name is Anthony. This is Lizzie. That's Andrew. And you may notice we have two very special guests. This is Ben and Mike, also hey. known as Falling Short. <laughs> What up, people? Yeah, I'm known as nothing else. That's right. yeah, that's <laughs> welcome, welcome to the show. You guys are our first guests ever. Let's get some Yo, applause. Thank you. <laughs> thank you so much. Yeah. I'm real excited to be here, dude. This is awesome. Yeah, man, We're cool. ready. Yeah, thanks for thanks for coming. Yeah, no problem. This is. Uh, I mean, I don't know. I'm I'm excited to be here. This is. Uh, it's an experience. Oh, I'm uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Welcome no, I've never been on a podcast. Home. Ben scared me a little bit when he walked in. He's like, yeah, I have some questions prepared for you guys. Like, oh, fuck. No, you didn't. No, it's not questions necessarily. It's just It sounds like you have questions. Stuff. No, we no, will just, not be taking questions. Yeah, no questions. The, the guests are... Uh, no further questions. Yeah. <laughs> no. All further questions will be uh, sent to our HR. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. which, yeah, you have to go through HR first. Uh, then is we'll talk is about that you? Are sure. you I feel HR? Like we need to address uh, it's also me. Yeah. We need to address it's, uh, this It's Kyle, his brother. You and me oh, yeah. So for those of you watching on video... And even the audio listeners might notice a little difference between me and Lizzie. We're sharing a mic. Yes, we are. We're peas in a pod over here. Thanks to Rode, the Rodecaster only has four mic inputs. <laughs> Sponsorship. Should have put Rode. five. <laughs> Sponsorship. No, I'm just kidding. The, the, eh, the Rodecaster is great, but it only has four, and we got five peeps. So, so Lizzie naturally, and I, are, I was uh, voted out. Well, <laughs> no. We're just. Uh, we're getting pretty comfortable tonight, yeah. so uh, getting pretty snug. You know, Attempting nudging yeah. shoulders with the celebs, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So how's everybody's week? How are we doing? I mean, so far so good. I, I can't really complain. We we just got back from Boston, which was mad. Oh, yeah, yeah. 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 I, I hear there's a lot nothing. of stories in Boston. Oh, uh, we got there, some I mean, stories Boston's to tell. Good. That's for sure. I want to hear these stories. Oh God! I mean, <laughs> uh, gonna, we're just gonna only... start right off. There was only Might one well. banger of a night. Oh, please share. Oh, I mean, it wasn't like, it was banger because we all just got hammered. It was like, uh, we that started earlier the in the day. Night. Yeah, yeah. It was <laughs> like, uh, we, I don't know. We started, I mean, at least I started at like fucking two or three in the afternoon. I was ready to go. We had nothing to do. So oh like, my God. Yeah. yeah so uh, I think we talked about LA movie nights. It's, it's, it's another thing that we do here um, with the entertainment in industry. Uh, we do drive-in movies, like pop-up drive-in movies. And, uh, Emphasis we, on pop-up. <laughs> <laughs> I think we could say this. So we we teamed up with T-Mobile, and we're we're going like all over the U.S. Yeah. like <laughs> doing yeah, we been all sorts point. of drive-ins, all different places. And uh, we went to Boston, and it was sick. Yeah, technically was, we went to Massachusetts. Yeah, Weymouth. Oh, Weymouth. It, it was yeah. like right outside of Boston. Yeah. So, yeah. Oh, so you guys yeah, lied. When I heard you were going. I yeah, thought we, you guys we were going to be like yeah, by all the bars, like by the strip. Like that. No, no, we that? were in some random, yeah. random, at all. random suburb. Random town. <laughs> yeah, he Facetimes me, and it's like I don't know, like a truck stop across the street or something yeah, like that. I was like, oh man. That's where they got dinner. It was a small like suburban town near like some industrial. We had some gas station. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, industrial. Yeah, yeah. yeah, exactly. yeah. Which uh, we found out something interesting. Uh, I guess being from New York, I don't know if you guys said that, but like, uh, or if you want to oh, mention boy. that. But uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, they're, so they're, 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 they're going to pinpoint us. Uh, <laughs> but uh, it's the Seven Elevens don't sell alcohol in yes. Boston. What the fuck he is? told me he was so pissed. That yeah. was so weird. No, it was like we just what, ran one a.m. two a.m. Yeah, yeah. We're like, we ran out of what we had. We're like, we're yeah. still ready to party. What's <laughs> going on here? <laughs> we walked to Seven Eleven. It's like three blocks away. Mm -hmm. And my mouth just dropped when I walked in. I was like, "Where is the beer?" Yeah, wait. So not you think, walked around. I think you asked the cashier. No, you yeah, were like, I, I, I thought it was like after a certain time they well, don't sell. No, it. no, they don't, they don't, sell don't even it stock it. And like, not, not to mention, Seven oh Elevens. We must take for granted around here because they're not twenty four seven in other places. Like oh our Seven Elevens are open all night. That's just how it is. And like we went to, we, we, we passed. We drove two. They were closed. At like what, like 11 30, so 12 o'clock? Like they was actually so, follow the name specifically. So it was so bizarre. Distributor? How bizarre. You have uh, to go. No, we didn't. I think we can see <laughs> so it. So you have right? to go we to the uh, yeah. <laughs> you have to go to the liquor store to get beer. Yes. Yeah, so really? the liquor store the liquor is store literally the only yeah. place to get out. Well, well, the I think liquor maybe store the supermarkets did. had it too. There's but some probably. beer distributors that serve liquor and. Right, but liquor stores are like wine, like spirits. I don't know. I, I mean, look like at their yeah. look at their Seven Eleven. They don't sell alcohol, so I guess it is very weird. That was something that we, we, we are, I guess, pr a privileged few. We didn't we didn't oh, expect that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah we're a little privileged. Yeah. Yeah. Another, <laughs> uh, another cool story about that is um, when we went to the liquor store. Oh yeah, we, we were looking. We were looking like, where can we get stuff? Like, where can we get like some a bottle? Where can we get some beer? And Anything. so I googled it, 
And the closest liquor store was, I forget the name exactly, but if you click on the Google images of it, it's a picture of a deer running around inside the liquor store. <laughs> yeah. It was on the news like a couple years ago. A deer broke into the liquor store and just trashed it. Wait, I saw that video. It was like it's, viral. It's a, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So That's the, where we were. That's the liquor store we went to. Yeah, no one of the liquor stores. That's really dope, yeah, actually. We, we talked Funny to one story. Of the, yeah, we talked to one You're of the... You're about to curse. He was, he was, I, <laughs> I caught myself. <laughs> this, this dude we spoke to was a character. He had like a, a, this, a SpongeBob face mask, like an eye patch. Looked kind of <laughs> oh, like... Oh, the guy was great. Yeah, he was, he was behind great. the counter? Yeah, behind the counter. And he was he mm-hmm. was telling us a story. We had, like, Mike, uh, he brought it up to him. He was like, oh, so what about this, what's this deer situation or whatever? And uh, the guy was like, oh, yeah, I was making breakfast. He's like, I never show up on time. And, like, uh, I, get, I get a call from uh, the, the the company or whatever. They're like, there's a deer running through the business. We need you to come here. Oh, and he was like, so like he, he can just, do anything. Yeah, he was. Like, like, so, yeah, exactly. Like, what, what he was so to close like, to finishing his eggs that morning. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's what he was telling us. I'm yeah. getting, like, real upstate vibes instead yeah. of, yeah. like, well, that was, it never was, been. It's a yeah, very it country like area. It was. It was. must it was be like to have a deer break into your local. We didn't see any deer. That was what was concerning. It was mostly, like... Like uh, from like you would cross the bridge and it looked like uh, industrial, like just across the the board, I guess. And yeah. like uh, just as like I don't know, it was like industrial and then like beaches. So mm-hmm. apparently a deer somehow made its way there and oh, like right. busted through the front. And but that uh, guy was uh, that was funny. That, that guy was uh, shitting on us until he like heard why yeah, we were yeah. there. Yeah, because he, yeah, yeah, he was really like, like oh wow, New York, you guys are vacationing in Weymouth. Yeah, he's we're like, what like, the hell? Are you <laughs> he's like, what the? He literally he looks at our he's like hot fucking dweeb. Yeah, yeah, literally he sees three IDs. <laughs> One more strike, you're out. <laughs> what are the strikes? Me no cursing. Oh, curse. oh, okay. Yeah, thankfully, she's uh, going after her big girl job. I was under the impression thankfully, this uh, was going to be like a Logan Paul situation where we could mm-hmm. put like like a rubber ducky over like sound when I curse. Oh, That's if that? we had a real editor. That's um, what he led me to okay. believe. Okay, Craigslist ad. If there's any real editors <laughs> yeah, out there, yeah, true, yeah, who <laughs> wants to come on the show. <laughs> We're hiring. We, we to, will hire you, but not pay you. Come yeah. through. We'll it's pay a, you and go. Strictly experience. <laughs> exactly. Um, so I guess uh, only. a way to uh, a segue this. So we were talking uh, about Boston or whatever, and one of the attractions to Boston was the haunted pirate ship, or, or Weymouth was one of these haunted pirate ships or whatever. And uh, I guess we were talking, we were like, uh, how, like, I guess however we feel about ghosts doesn't matter. But I, I guess mm. what I was asking, or what I was thinking to ask, was do you guys have any ghost stories in particular that like oh, it, like gosh. regardless of regardless of what I don't, I don't know like anyone believes of ghosts like do you have anything that you believe that bro like, he's like a host over here <laughs> yeah, he Come came to uh, I'm quitting, I'm quitting. <laughs> yeah. 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 Well, no, no, Ben's the new no, host because no, we were saying we were, we were talking about a ghost ship and I was like well I don't give a fuck I'd love to stay on a ghost ship and see ghosts I'd love to see a oh, ghost no. and like so I was curious like well I, I feel a certain way about ghosts do you guys okay. I think like do you have any things where you're like I think I saw something because I, I don't know that's curious uh, that's curious to me I actually went on uh, a couple of these paranormal Paranormal investigations. Okay. With a real, like, Dude, a paranormal team, right? in- <laughs> investigation team. That was a while ago. Yeah. Yeah, it was uh, five, six years ago, maybe. Mm, yeah. Something um, like that. Shout out to Dawn Jo Lee. She is a psychic medium. <laughs> uh, Interesting. <laughs> <laughs> sure. So she what came over my house. My mom invited her over. I had like a psychic party. Did you and, sage? Uh, <laughs> a psychic what? Did you sage? Like, no, after no, all no, we didn't sage. Well, that's a mistake. It's positive vibes First only. <laughs> it's positive vibes only. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, so she had an assistant. Her name is Liz. And uh, I I got to know them a lot more like after that. And uh, Liz did paranormal investigations. That was her thing. So she's like, yeah, I need a new tech. You know, is that something you'd be interested in? And I was like, I mean, I've never done that anything like that Ghost before. Ghost tech, Anthony. Like, <laughs> come on. <laughs> So it's, yeah. it's another thing I can add to my resume. Yeah, yeah, ghost oh. technician. Yeah. So, um, oh, she's ghost tech for, uh, yeah, we went on two investigations. <laughs> um, one was residential, one was a house. Okay. Didn't find anything. They said they heard things in the attic. So we were in the attic recording video and audio. Rats, yo. Didn't find anything. <laughs> and then I think the second you. one was like just to like be more likely to find something. Okay. So we went to a cemetery. Interesting. Nice. And uh, didn't find anything. Damn. I mean, they're so. all dead. <laughs> True. <laughs> well, you know, well, there was a fence around it. So, you know. Yeah, you people about, were like, dying to dying get in. Dying to get in there, dude. Oh, 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 
Oh my god. Where's the shot? Yeah. This my is favorite, why we my have favorite the dad, dad joke. joke. Ask me about my dad <laughs> joke. I think I made that. We were talking you about that joke. You can get this hat. We passed yeah. so You can get this hat right now on the quackcrew.com slash shop. <laughs> this shirt, too. Butter my butt and call me a biscuit. <laughs> for Quacker. That's fantastic. But back to uh, some ghost stories. Yeah, yeah. How about so you guys? Do you either? And Not Liz? really. No? I mean... In the middle of sleep, and then you wake up because you feel like someone you're, touched you're you. Or like, oh, I feel like, like that happens like that. to everybody. Oh, yeah. But the, I feel like no. that, yeah, that's pretty normal for the most part. But, uh, like, an actual experience? No. I do. Okay. No. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. All right. Let's, let's, let's hear it. Let's hear it. Not that I can remember, at least. Okay. 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 Um, I, I don't know. So I never really believed in ghosts because I was just brought up like really religious. So my mom okay. was like, oh, come on. Like that's, See, that's inter- I, I'll let you, I guess, go, but I feel like it would be the inverse, you know? Right. Like, like I don't know, like spiritual, like you kind of believe that you can have like visits from like your mm-hmm. loved ones and stuff. But she was, she would put in my head like, oh, why would God like let like a bad spirit? You know what I'm saying? That's, that's a, that's right. An and as a kid, I ate that yeah. up because I didn't want to think that like yeah. demons and shit were okay. like, I feel like they're not necessarily like bad spirits. Though. But no, right. but that is, exactly. that, is, that is interesting. Like why, why would God not allow them to go? Why would he I let know. them stay? So I, I've never actually heard that before. Very that's interesting. interesting. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Religion yeah. isn't purgatory a thing? Like that middle ground? Yes. My mom believes in purgatory. I feel like that's like a, Specific sect. I don't know. I don't know. Like, yeah, I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't know how many Christians believe in purgatory, but I know. Yeah, yeah I'm I don't with know. it. it anyway, cool. no, <laughs> not to bring religion into this. Purgatory but. sounds like the worst thing on the planet, dude. You're, you're just hanging out, waiting. No, but the no, that's not true. The, 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 the individuals in purgatory are. It includes the people who died before birth who were never baptized. That's what purgatory includes. Hold them. No, dude. I am this old when I'm finding that. Yeah, out. no, but purgatory. Today years. I don't think my mom knows. That. Purgatory is, is I need to well, tell purgatory that. isn't even like oh my it's god, the this, is a whole, pretty much. <laughs> this is a whole thing because purgatory is like, ground. from what I understand, was only really in, introduced through like a, what's it called Dante's Inferno, which is that like religious, yes. like a like fear mongering type, yes. Book. But it, I don't know because according to that book, I'm going to hell, yeah. Well, a lot of people are for like, uh, the Bible, yeah, because mama, mama yeah, like god damn, I said I didn't want to talk about <laughs> yeah. I was even talking about it, I don't want to talk about this, shit. but uh, yeah, purgatory is not what. Or at least from Dante's Inferno, which is, I believe, where that came from. I don't know if that's 100% I don't true, know. but uh, yeah, purgatory includes all the people who were never baptized. So Yikes. that's a lot of people. I, yeah, I was baptized. Yeah, yeah. I was baptized. Yeah, well, yeah, no, no, exactly. <laughs> yeah. 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 I, was, I, was, I was baptized. I was baptized and confirmed, dude. Me and Jesus are Same, like this. Bro, so I'm fucking ready. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I got yeah, I don't, th- I don't think you'll go to heaven because you have tattoos. Oh. Uh-oh. No, that's... Oh. Oh. Not. See, you <laughs> <fuckers> <laughs> in hell. I'm Holy sorry. shit, yeah. No, no. Anyway. Oh, so, man. Like, I, I, no, please. I have, that's very interesting. But I feel like I had a few things. Um, there's a lot, actually. The most recent... You remember this. There's a house near me, like, one of these blocks, and it's just covered in, like, graffiti okay. and... He has like mannequins hanging outside, oh, I love it. <laughs> like baby oh, dolls with like no head. This guy is so scary. Like this guy is very so scary. his car. It's someone's home. Yes. Nice. And like you walk by it and it smells like old musty attic. I don't know. So hmm. we were walking by and I just got chills. Like we were going for a walk, and I was just like, oh, and I got so fucking creeped out. So I just got so creeped out and I go home and I'm like trying not to think about it, but it's in the back of my mind. I'm like, I don't know, just something doesn't feel right. And this just sounds so crazy. But like for months, I don't know if my brain was playing tricks on me, but like out of the corner of my eye, like I would see like a little girl all the time. And now I will not walk past that street. I hold my (laughs) breath. Like what? That sounds so crazy, but I'm like, I walk past the street and I just like tense up and I can't go near the house or anything because Mm -hmm. I'm convinced it just like, so I saged and like, I tried like, okay, not all spirits are bad. Like, is there something going on? Can I help in some way? Like, I don't know. It was just a real out of like body That's not experience. Fifth sense. Yes. Did you start having dreams about it? I've had like I don't know. The I've had like sense. night terrors. Right, I hope that was a joke life. with this girl. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like Wait, is it, I, there's a joke ending. No, 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 no. Because no. <laughs> Mike said like a fifth sense. Was that a was Mean Girls reference yeah. or anything? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm the yeah, only yeah. girl here. No, no, no. I did. If you meant that seriously, I was gonna freak out because like yeah, it's like if you've seen me, I've seen this twice or three times working with you guys. I've seen it. Yeah, the girl's like, I have a fifth sense, and it's like yeah, everyone has five senses. Wait, it's raining. Yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah, she always moves. 
yeah, 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 yeah. It's just oh like, I, yeah, she goes and she's like, I have a fifth sense or whatever. Oh, it's like, I, I wish I had yeah, more yeah. quotes. I wish I had more quotes. I love movie quotes. I can't remember any. Bro, Mean Girls, I remember I'd heard so much about that movie and I had never seen it until I started working with you guys and doing private movies. And I like, it was genuine. I love that movie so much. I was, on Wednesday. I'm not going to lie. That sounds pretty dirty. Yes. Yeah. 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 When I started working with you guys doing private movies. No, no, yeah. Doing private shows by myself, you know, half naked. And, uh, oh. Yeah. It's, uh, <laughs> no, but. Wait, um, I want to ask about, sorry, real quickly. Do you think like night terrors are related to ghosts in any way? No. I feel like it no. depends. Okay. Uh, well, it depends on like, I guess your, your beliefs or whatever, but, uh, I feel like because night terrors could mean like cause, like sleep paralysis. Yeah. You know? Like uh, I'm like I feel like that's kind of its own deal. Like I've never experienced that. I don't know if you guys. I've have. I've had it a few times, so that's why I'm wondering. Sounds like is like that the most horrible. Actually, like a, I've never had night terrors. Yeah. Like I've never I've never had a time where it's like uh, like I've had like nightmares or whatever, which uh, like you know that's that's like you're talking about thing, like but, extreme shit where you're like screaming. Well, I wasn't screaming, but like I couldn't move. I saw it like over yeah. paralysis. me. Sleep paralysis. Sleep yes. paralysis. Yeah, yeah. And I was like. I could just explain it like a like a Dementor from Harry Potter. Yeah, you know? I know. Like, exactly. That's yeah, yeah, literally, okay. and um, I saw it like coming from across the room until it was like over my body, yeah. and like I wanted to scream, but I couldn't say anything, and like I couldn't move. Mm. And Damn. this happened to me a few times when I was really, really young, like having sleepovers with Morgan, and Damn. I'd have to go home. And I've had it like a few times, and I just wonder. I don't know. That's a. I mean, <laughs> I don't know. That's a. That's like a an interesting thing. I know. Uh, like when it comes to sleep paralysis, people say they, they tend to experience it more when they're laying on their backs. I don't know if you sleep on your back. Or... I don't sleep on my okay. back and I was on my back okay, during yeah. those oh, times. A lot of, a lot of, a lot of people it's like, facts. I mean, for I've like read that quick, well. I guess, uh, I guess quickie fucking notes on the, the sleep paralysis. From what I understand, it's like, I'm a... learning so many things from you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, like uh, it's when, when you're on your back or whatever i mean i I feel like uh, at least on the internet most people claim that it happens more likely when you're on your back but it's just your your half of your or like three quarters half of your body is just fall has fallen asleep except for the your brain and your brain (laughs) i'm never sleeping on my back i can add to this so i I guess your brain your your brain recognizes that you can't move your body and then like not not, i'm sorry not that it recognizes that you can move your body but it um like it, it realizes there's something wrong, right? So you're laying, you're, you're, yeah, you're laying in bed and your eyes are open, oh but you're, the rest my. of your body is asleep, right? Mm-hmm. So you, I guess you, you would never like, oh, fuck, not you would never. Um, your your body starts like, I guess, freaking out. It, it, yeah. it notices that it's awake, but the rest of your body can't move and you can't force it to move. So then, like. When you get, you start to panic, right? And when so you start to panic, where does the demon come in? Is that like well, your dream? I, I think, it's no, a dream, I, but I think, you're awake. I think, I think that's. I mean, I don't know this for sure, but I'd say that's more of the panic of you going like being in bed and being like, "What the fuck is happening? Yeah. Like, why can't I move my body?" And like, uh, and then starting to like put things where things aren't, you like know? hallucinating yeah, yeah, exactly, into being exactly where you you're, you're <laughs> laying there and you think of something, and then suddenly the thing you think of starts to happen. Because yeah. like, yeah, I think that only happens when you're in your REM cycle. I don't know. I, I couldn't tell you that. I personally never experienced sleep paralysis, it's but I, I know day. people who it's have, gnarly. and I've That's heard weird. stories online of people You've who have. You've done it? I mean, not on purpose. No. But. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he does it. He does it for enjoyment. <laughs> I'd hope not. I'd hope not. But, do that on but to add on to this, supposedly, I read like a few different articles about this. If you sleep on your left side, you're more likely to have bad dreams. <laughs> if you sleep on your right side, you're more likely to have good dreams. If you sleep on your stomach, I sleep on my stomach. Yeah, I sleep. I, oh, uh, sleep on my right. Side. I don't want to say it now. <laughs> say you're, it. You're, you're, you're screwed. Oh. If you sleep on your stomach, you you're die. screwed. You're gonna <laughs> die. No, oh it's, you're just gonna die. I mean, you know, fuck it. No, you have to. You say may as well it. just what hand is, in your ticket says, now. Take a drink. <laughs> what happens when you sleep on your stomach? Yeah, what supposedly, do you need to for? supposedly, when you sleep on your stomach, you're, you're supposed to. You're gonna get hired somewhere. You're, you're supposed to have more like. Like sexualized dreams. He says you're gonna get hired somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> sexualized dreams. Interesting. And your back is like she's gonna sleep on your like stomach. Like all the time. Time. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, I'm gonna. I'm like, can I? I'm, I'm laying a face. But down, yeah, dude. I read that. In a, I read that in a few different places, and supposedly um, it has to do with like kind of your organs, like really, sort of. Mm-hmm. See, I don't know if this is. A, There's pressure is... on your heart in certain places, okay. so like, yeah. you're more to panic if so, you're like on this side or something. Interesting. Yeah. I don't know if you guys feel the same way, but personally, like, 
Like I sleep on my side, right? I, I guess I sleep on my right side. You have good dreams. And no, I don't have any <laughs> dreams. We've talked about this, You're right? Same. I have no same. aspirations. He dream at I all. barely, yeah, I barely well, have any see, dreams. I have crazy. an excuse. I, I'm not an excuse. I, I, I guess I just smoke. So it's like it's a bit different. So like apparently when you smoke it, it like a, it, uh, what like suppresses your REM sleep, which is where you dream, like your rap, rapid eye movement or whatever. And like really? uh, that's not yeah. fun. What? That's not fun. My no, wife? no, no. Well, it's not that it's not fun. I, I mean, I, I guess I don't know. But like, if you smoke before, I thought you're gonna you, pour the water. <laughs> if you smoke before you go to sleep. I, I mean, I don't know how true this science is, but apparently, uh, y- your rapid eye movement sleep or REM sleep, which is like the deepest sleep you can get into, yeah. it, it like prevents you from getting there, so you don't dream as much. And uh, I don't know. That's like I, I've talked to people about. We talked about this on the. He doesn't the Boston smoke trip. at all, but my brother yeah. smokes all the time, and he has like horrible nightmares constantly. Oh my god, that's horrifying. Yeah. No, no, I haven't dreamed in years. I don't know. Like, I got, like <laughs> that's it's, crazy. Yeah, dream yeah. every night. Same dude. Oh, every I guess, night. God, I'm doxing Multiple. myself. I guess. Multiple. But, uh, yeah, but well, in fine. like a few minutes, you no, can yeah, have like, like I'll, three dreams. I'll, yeah, like I'll I'll fall asleep. No. Dream of it. No. And I'll wake up. When I was younger, I used to go back to dreams. Like I'd wake up and be like, oh. No, I want to go back to that, and I'll just put myself back to sleep and like wake what? up right there. What? No, I've never no, been able that. to. Do I used that. to be able to yeah. control my dreams as well. No, my mom says that. That's pretty cool. It was really fun. Like I, I had, I had a few repeat dreams, and That's like weird. most of them were bad dreams. But the second time around, like I remembered what happened, so I was like, "Oh, I'm getting out of this room. Like I don't want to <laughs> die right now." Like, and you I must just have like away. a superior mind because my I, mom did that. She's like, I just fly away. I'm like, the fuck, you fly away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, I just pick them. I just you sure, you, you, sure, yeah. Yeah. you sure you don't and do I drugs, mom? Yeah, I just, yeah. I just, I just, it I just send it. I send it in my dreams and go. Like, I just say go away and it goes away. <laughs> <laughs> like that is some like almighty power that you have there. Like no, you, but, know, uh, you, won't, you shall not bother me. You I know what's happened to me? So like, let's say you're in a. I'm in a like a interactive dream like nice. uh, i guess that's a yeah, some yeah, way of putting exactly. it a dream a dream that i that's it. pretty exciting yeah. <laughs> right you can feel it. <laughs> Ex- no exciting not like <laughs> so very, very uh, i wake exciting. up in the middle of it and i'm like damn like i want to see what happens i go back to sleep and i go right back into it hell yeah mm-hmm. really I yeah that's happened to me a couple times every time i wake up from a dream i can't get back into it I, I feel yeah, like i've been able it'll to be get like a really good dream like you gotta like keep it on your mind that's what I do because as soon as I wake up, I'm like, when I okay, do. this is what happened. This is what's mm. happening right now. Oh, see, no. And then I go like, right back I've into had, it. I've had dreams where I wake up and I'm like, no, go back. Like, fuck. Like, oh, <laughs> yeah. I was kind of shit. To get to the good but, no, no, I've never, I've never actually like gotten back to it. I guess uh, uh, what what is that loose dreaming? Yeah, yeah lucid dreaming, dreaming is being able yeah. to control. Yeah, yeah, where you, you control. I, I, I only experienced one time where Juice I World. got close to it. I was it. just going to say R.I.P. Juice World. Oh, shit, yeah. R.I.P. Juice. R. I. Never listened to him, R.I.P. Uh, <laughs> but uh, one of the only, like, a, 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 a not attempts, but, like, a, a closest I've had at lucid dreaming, I guess, was, uh, I, I like, I had a dream where I was in my own house, and uh, my sister had this, like, uh, you know those things you hang on the doors, kind of like it was like this cute little like pink thing, and it was like it was it was, it was like it was like oh like a, a prince catcher. like a princess oh. like uh, owns this room or some shit okay, like that. Okay. And uh, I, I remember uh, like a little sign. Yeah, yeah, like a little sign. And okay. I, I remember walking oh, up I have one of those uh, in, in my dream. <laughs> in, in my dream, I remember I remember walking up to it and it read something else, and I was like, "Well, that's weird." And I woke up. I woke up immediately. I noticed that what it was there was wrong, and I was just like, "Oh, I must be dreaming." And I just woke up immediately. The so one dream. That's because you noticed it. Yeah, no, no, no. I noticed. I noticed exactly. Like that was the only the only time I can think of where I actually saw something that I recognized was wrong, and I was like, mm-hmm. "Oh, I must be dreaming." And then I, I, I instantly woke up. Wait, never... they say everything we see in dreams, like people we've seen before. So mm-hmm. that's really funny that you could pinpoint in your dream. Well, that it was. It was, was like it was also. It was like it was my house. It was like a, I, I walked. Like I got out of my room. I walked out. My sister's room is like. If I walked out, it was like there's a little hallway and then there's my my sister's room. And it was something that I was so used to seeing that when yeah. I saw that, it was like something that I guess my mind told me it but was. But in your dream, like, you're like, yeah. no, this and isn't right. And I looked at that and I was like, well, that doesn't seem right. And then it was what? me, like, you're right. And I fucking woke up. Like, <laughs> that's the key, though. That's yeah. the key you're to too lucid smart dream. For, he's too smart for dreaming. The key to lucid yeah. dreaming. No, that's, that's the only time that's ever happened. I've had dumb dreams in the past where I didn't notice, like, like, 
I, like uh, suddenly I'm in like World War Two or whatever, and yeah, it's just like it's a clearly battle. bullshit. It's, no, 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 it's clearly bullshit. It's just a, a battlefield. He's a Freddy Krueger like, of his dreams. Yeah, yeah. And I'm like, <laughs> this is real. Like I sit there, I'm like, oh yeah, this is this makes sense. But that was the only time I'd ever considered. Hey, maybe this is wrong. So is that lucid dreaming? The key, no, the I, key I, think, to, I think lucid dreaming would be it's recognizing. Contri- yeah, it's recognizing and mm-hmm. staying within it. Exactly. Okay. Rec- like, but so, that's the major yeah. key of it. Is like the major, major key. key alert. It's um, you you have to recognize that, that you're dreaming you but not control it book. too much because <laughs> when you try and control your dreams too much you'll wake yourself up okay you can't put too much control in it Damn. you have to like control a little bit you know get your little touches in there and then like just go for the ride with it but if the second you're like doing some crazy shit you're out. You're waking How do up. I like tap flying. Into this? Yeah. <laughs> I feel like this is the yeah, matrix. Gotta, I don't. I, I truly don't know. Like apparently, it's something like but a lot of people can't do. I don't know. People yeah. people claim some bullshit. Uh, so like uh, uh, like <laughs> <laughs> that's how you tap into it. Yeah, tap into it. If you guys ever wondered how to tap yeah. into that, no, the, yeah, I the, thought I had something on my head. I was like, yeah. On that <laughs> note, we're gonna take a brief break. We'll be right back. Uh, Here we go. Again. While we're okay. away, make sure you stop by the quadcrew.com. Check out the quadcrew.com <laughs> and, slash um, shop. You, and falling <laughs> short on Spotify. Make sure you follow shit. falling short. It's falling underscore sh- short, right? Two T's. Two T's. Yeah. All right, we'll see you when we get back. Welcome back to the Quadcast, everybody. I'm Anthony. That's Z, That's Andrew. Hello, that's Ben. Hello. And that's falling short, a.k.a. Mike Woo. Short. <laughs> With two T's. Yes. With two T's. Nice. Two T's. Had to preface. So we so, were uh, we were touching upon sleep paralysis. Yeah, yeah. I wanted to ask you guys because you guys know a lot about it. So, I don't know uh, about that, but like, well, yeah, it seems yeah, like yeah, it. It seems like it. Sleep paralysis so like, um, kind of I would be. It's happened a couple of times, like mostly on like flights. Okay. What? So I'll be sleeping, Damn, right? On a fucking plane. No, I'll be God. sleeping, and then I'll wake up. <laughs> Holy shit! I know I'm awake because I could look around. Mm-hmm. Well, not really look around, but my eyes. My eyes will move around. I can't like move my whole like head oh, yeah. or anything, oh, and I can't move. On the plane. And on the plane, so I'm just sitting there like because usually I fall asleep frontier? like this. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> usually I fall asleep <laughs> like this. That's, no, 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 that's some spirit you're, airline you're shit. Yeah, you're talking about spirit. You're talking about spirit. Frontier. Oh my god, well, I have a story about that. But yeah. usually I fall asleep like this, and now I'm like, and then I can't move, and I'm like, what the, what the hell? Looking around. That's creepy. And then eventually I snap back into it, and I'm able to release my arms. That, is that happened terrifying. a couple times. Yeah, that's yeah. that's paralysis no, for sure. Absolutely. Or sometimes I'll be like leaning like this because like you know how you fall asleep and then you yeah. just you lean forward. And then I wake up and I'm like this and I can't move. <laughs> oh yeah, my God. And I'm yeah, like, dude. Yo, these people are looking at me right now and I'm like, they probably think I'm on just something. Just close your eyes and pretend to keep sleeping. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> and just like this, like a little hunched over. Like, <gasps> just for the <laughs> for the record. Man, it's good. We are not doctors. <laughs> yeah, definitely. I know, I know absolutely no. nothing about <laughs> close. sleep paralysis. I guess <laughs> that's something to preface this with. I got an associate's degree from a community college. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'm not. I'm not an expert on sleep or any sort of thing. I, I was uh, forced to memorize sleep formulas in a psych class, but that's oh, not. Oh man, I don't. Yeah, no, it's miserable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 absolutely not. I think it was like what, like IPOVA or some shit. It was some formula to like how sleep happens, but we never really yeah. discussed it. Mm. Like, I, oh, me come closer. Yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I saw something at like my Me room. come closer. Yeah. And I'm like, yeah. hey, like scratching or something. Like, I'm like, yeah, yeah. Sorry about like, that. He's um, hot right now. Yeah, yeah. I, I believe we, we were talking about uh, a, a ghost experiences or whatever. Yes. I don't know if either of you, like, any, like, are there any more ghost stories? I don't know. Like, really. No? No? All right. Well, like, uh, I, I suppose there's a. There's a ghost story that I believe to be real, and my friends faked me out with it that for for a while. And uh, I guess I don't know how to start this, but like uh, one of my friends, his neighbor had an abandoned house, right? So oh, Lord. Um, it's always how they yeah, start. Exactly. Like, <laughs> the, the type of situation. Little where Tommy it, used to where live where there. It gets, sketchy, just, yeah, where it gets sketchy. And uh, so my friend had a uh, a uh, an abandoned neighbor, and uh, like we we weren't sure the the cause of whatever happened to that family, but we Tokyo were only assuming that it was bad. Shit. Bad type shit, and uh, we uh, there was one day we all Probably. like. Um, Can we do some hear this? shit going down? I hear, I hear the outside. No, 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 no. It's like crazy. drag racing or something. Oh, okay. Yeah. I was I like, I don't even know. Yeah, I was yeah. like, I think we should move to a bunker location. <laughs> <laughs> I can't hear anything. I have headphones. You don't, you don't okay. have, like, 
please. I only hear you guys. I have a bunker in Mount Chiliad. Oh, um, God. Mount Chiliad? Mm, yeah, me too. <laughs> <laughs> so, so what um, was this story? So me and my friends uh, one day... We decide that it would be a good idea to investigate this person's uh, cellar. Why like, uh, like, like, like they weren't know. alive. Yeah, yeah. No, You're they dead. weren't alive. They were, okay. they were, they were deceased. And uh, oh my word, we see. You know, this person has a backyard. They have a basement cellar. You know, the fucking open doors, the whole biz. So we're like, oh, you know, yeah, let's check that out. So me and my friends, we get horrible gas. idea. We, yeah, we get gas masks <laughs> on. We we would go in there, and um, at the time, I suppose I was gullible. Uh, we. We walk into this basement and we see we're wearing gas masks or whatever because we're we're worried about mold in, in this person's abandoned house and uh, so yeah this is all legal we uh, legally break into this person's home and <laughs> How do you uh, legally break and like into uh, someone's home we, we like enter the first <laughs> yeah we yeah, we, we uh, yeah, exactly <laughs> we enter the person's cellar and um, we were disturbed to say the least I suppose. We, we, we look around and we see we see a whip and we see like uh, we see this basement where it, which I assume now could was be like kinky stuff was, was yeah, normal for, what was normal for this basement but uh, yeah. Yeah. Ancient yeah. Sex when, when, when you're a child oh when you're a child you assume crazy things and like uh, <laughs> we, we walk through this basement and where the tiles I, I, I guess uh, were like the concrete slabs were put together there was like what looked like these like uh, these these crevices in the ground that kind of led to a circular point or whatever like coming down like so you know we assume like oh my god sacrifice the blood fucking circulates down into all these things and we saw whips we saw all these things and like we're, we're disturbed right so we, we how find, old were you can i just uh this was like middle school so this oh was probably my. like seventh eighth grade i'm 24 and yeah, i yeah, was yeah. disturbed this, uh, this was things. uh i mean i can't mention the, the specific was it george property. force's home no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> we broke into that home too i've, I've, I've got it i have, I have <laughs> someone I have you don't like <laughs> legally we'll say legally broken into the house of uh other house homes before but this is how many yeah, times yeah, yeah. you break into uh, home you, know, well, you don't see an abandoned building type thing when you see an abandoned building, you want to go in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's hard to legally enter an abandoned I building, so know. we we try our best. <laughs> uh, but uh, in this particular story, there was, um, you know, I was young, and we we enter this person's basement. We do like reconnaissance or whatever the fuck. And uh, I'm sorry, what? Reconnaissance. Oh, yeah, we're, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we, we the Renaissance fair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> what? I was like, is this some ritual shit? And, uh, so we go through there. We pull out uh, like uh, random objects. There's like a family, uh, like a family photo book, and all this like stuff. And um, that's where the like, uh, this is some this horror is what you do. movie shit. I'm sorry, I keep cutting, keep cutting, no, keep cutting. No, 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 it's fine. It's you so, go through the photo book, and you just no. see them standing there, like creepily, just like in the same location yeah. that we're. I at. feel like, like no, no, no. I'm. Like listening to the plot of a horror movie, I really yeah. want to so, know how this. Well, ends. so we were. I guess I was jubated. I was baited, and like uh, the the jubate. Yeah, jub, 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 <laughs> jubate. And like, uh, what happened was, uh, we we do we go through this basement. We see like, oh my god, there's like a weird picture. And then my friends from beforehand are like, yeah, we found bones in the basement or whatever. And like, uh, we, we we go through the basement. We come out, and like a couple days later, this was like we were playing games. We we're on Skype or whatever. We we're, were talking. That was like how we communicated. And uh, mm -hmm. I get a phone call from one of my friends on Skype who lives mm -hmm. right next door to this this person. And uh, <clears throat> they send me a message. They're like, "Hey man, I really want to talk. I think something's fucked up is happening." And they say, uh, "I looked outside my window, and from their window is a clear spot to the cellar that we went to." And he said the doors were open when we left like the, we closed the doors we left the doors were still open to the cellar so i'm like that's fucking weird like someone I, went in yeah yeah, yeah. some well, like who went in what the hell why the door is open we closed it no one's been there like what so we're like i'm asking all these questions to myself and uh they they start like unbeknownst to me they start this elaborate story where they're like oh my god my friend um uh, one of our friends he had recorded scratches at his window but it's he's on the second floor of his house so that doesn't make any sense <laughs> how could someone be scratching the window mm. when he's two stories up so we get all these weird things like uh like why is this happening like uh, like uh, is there really ghosts like the door is open what the fuck is happening so uh, uh, uh like i guess ironically i don't know if that there was a situation that had happened to me where like my family has a like a, a boat or whatever and when you have a boat the uh, common practice is to uh, like clear the boat of all its salt water because you don't want the motor to be fucked up with salt in it, right? Uh, so you, you put these things on it and you fill it with water and you flush the whole system out or whatever. So a couple of days before this whole situation happened, 
there were barefoot footprints leading wet barefoot footprints leading up from where we finished the like the uh, drained out the boat up, <laughs> Done. Up, yeah. up, up to the, the up to the back I'm listening up, so intently yeah, I'm no, like no, up to the back door of my house right so we see these wet barefoot footprints leading up to the door they lead to the door they stop right Legit. so this happens like four days before this whole like like before they start coming to me about this ghost quote unquote ghost situation and uh so I'm thinking Oh my God! This fucking yeah. ghost left the basement of this house and is now walking, uh, like allegedly. You guys let it break. Walking, you guys walking, let it break. walking, walking through, behind allegedly. me. Walking Keyword through the, allegedly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Walking through the puddle of my back house up to the doorway and stopping. And we're like, "You what the? Like, his my then his friends then his go friends go around and put salt. Went back to look at the door and in small letters it says, "Please don't open." Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 like wet paint. But like. So I have this like confirmation bias to myself. Oh my god, I saw footprints leading to my house after this ghost event. Oh my god, the ghost is in my house, like type shit. Hold on. And we had a uh, two people claim that they saw they heard scratching or saw scratching at their doors and windows. And I, I swear to God, I was the like when I got the Skype call, I was horrified. I, I slept that night with my door wide open, hall light on, my lights on. I was hor I was like, Oh my god, this fucking ghost is here and he's out for vengeance. I shouldn't have walked into this person. Isn't that basement. funny? Like as a kid, like, like what are you gonna do? Like fight off the ghost? Exactly. Like, like, what are you gonna do if there is a ghost? What am I to do against this ghost? You gotta do what you gotta do. You gotta do, what you gotta do. <laughs> yeah, yeah, wait, exactly. isn't there, oh wait, isn't there a saying where like if you punch a ghost in the nose, it'll leave you alone? That's a shark. <laughs> That's a shark. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I need to brought, like bring to the attention of the camera that Anthony put his hand on my lap. Uh-oh. Every podcast we talk about it, we're like, Anthony doesn't show me any PDA. No so. PDA? So we had Damn, to. Dude, making it. Breaking it. Breaking it. Making it so uncomfortable. He's like sliding his hand I back. I too. <laughs> I too have my significant other here. Oh, <laughs> the sketch the pillow. Oh you got to show the camera behind you. <laughs> Every angle of sketch. Yeah. <laughs> a meme that we have at this work workplace. Sketch where the the pillow, did this pillow. pillow come from? Sketch the what pillow is, is a enjoyable entertainment. I mean, I created it. I don't know if it's accepted, but <laughs> oh how it started is we started doing um, our drive-in movies in um, what, like April of uh, 2020, and um, we were going all the way out to. Astoria or somewhere like that, Queens. Yeah, yeah it's Astoria. And um, it was a long drive, and um, <laughs> we had nowhere <laughs> where we had to sit was like on little lawn chairs or something, whatever we brought. So I didn't have a comfy seat, so I brought <laughs> Sketch the Pillow with oh me, my God. and um, Sketch the Pillow was my seat, and um, so he just stayed in the van the whole time, and eventually we stopped doing shows at um, at the diner we were at. But Sketch stayed in the van, and uh, eventually our boss came up to me, our boss Will. He came up. He's like, dude, um, what's this pillow in the van? <laughs> like, <laughs> what's this sketchy ass pillow I was doing like, in oh, my van? I was like, it's my pillow, dude. It was in my car for I don't know how long. I don't know why it was in the car. And um, he was like, well, do you, do you want to take it? And I was like, sure. And then I came in. I drew, I drew Sketch's face. <laughs> And, and the pillow was born. And he was born, and he gets <laughs> hid all around the all around the warehouse. Yeah, uh, I was just about to say. Now um, he just like finds his way all around the warehouse. Like we take turns, just like Elf on the Shelf. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> he was, looks um, like something out of. I'm sorry. What? Go ahead. No, I no, want no, to no, say no. he looks like something out of Adventure Time. Okay. Was, uh, Please keep going. He's got a hell of a schnoz. A little bit. A little bit. Like a SpongeBob type of show. Who's that guy? He's like unacceptable. <laughs> <laughs> this is Justin Roiland. Yeah. Holy shit. Yeah. There was a. This isn't really a ghost story, but I, I'm pretty sure you were there. It was a bunch of us, and we went to it. It was an abandoned house, like a like a mansion. Nice. Re- remember that really really nice abandoned house? Was that in Stony Brook? I think so. Oh, so. I remember oh, that. Oh like my god. Yeah. So we went we back Pretty went back nice. like a couple times. Because this house is really old, like. Really nice, but uh, no one had lived there for a while. Yeah, so it was like super run down, like we go in, she rock was falling. Huge house, right? Mm-hmm. Had a pool inside. Okay. A very oh long pool. God. Yeah, like a like Olympic type swimming very pool. Very long yeah. pool yeah. inside, it was yeah. Massive. Bougie so, ass um, people. Hell yeah. You know there's like leaves and the water's like black, so you don't know what's yeah, yeah. like towards the bottom. So just <laughs> right there. Demons. Right? 
You go upstairs. I only remember that room, and then there was a room upstairs. It had to have been like a ballet room or something. So you walk inside, and there's just this long mirror. Oh, God. On the wall. Nice. So now already there is like scary as hell. So Bloody one, I think it was one of the last. <laughs> the last time we went, we're all in. We're all inside. We kept getting bringing more and more people to come with us. I think an alarm went off. Great. Like a really yeah. loud alarm. So we all yeah, freaked down and ran. They have a and burglar then, alarm, but the pool's nothing black. Nothing ever happened from that. Was there. The, the alarm still worked. Yeah, the house Damn. is abandoned. Nothing yeah. ever happened from that. But I was just thinking about it because we were thinking uh, talking about abandoned houses. <laughs> yeah, that was a good time. That was a car exhaust. What's going on outside? There was crazy things going on outside. Deer Park is a strange place. Literally. But that was Technically so Brentwood. Funny. There, Brentwood. There, I wish Which they makes could more sense. This. I want to like take a little I microphone hear in here, outside. Like I hear it. Yeah, it's just... <sighs> wouldn't police get involved? Aren't they... Are they drag racing out there? Like, what's going on? Most definitely they are drag racing. So how come racing. there's no police All involved? I hear in the headphones is... Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, we got. I mean, we're wow, right next to a train station. A good, was it that good? That was that was a really great. <laughs> was that a pause? Yep. Oh. You have them written on there. You cheat. They what, have what to hear that. I kind of want to go look at like, the cameras probably. and like do like a blinding Can lights kind of thing and like go out there and like. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm for, gonna, for all for all you people you watching, go look. We uh, the warehouse is right. right by a train station. Report back to us. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but. Take How some, take some videos. Can, if you see anything that's yeah. good, we'll use the ring, ring camera footage. <laughs> tell them, tell them to come out here so we can get some more people. <laughs> they all in come in here. Yeah. <laughs> Mike locks himself out. <laughs> see, I, I never think of him as Mike because I always hear him referred to as short. So, short, yeah. so when he was like, "Oh, Mike," you told me something when you were in Boston. You're like, "Oh, Mike, this and that," and I was like, "Who the hell is Mike?" Yeah. And he's like, and she's like, Mike's having who over? What? <laughs> <laughs> That's what it was. I'm like, I'm like, Mike's short, babe. Short. 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 Oh, no. I, short think, I think the Tokyo Drift enthusiast took him away. He didn't come back <laughs> yet. And I hear the engines like. Oh, man. He, he, he suddenly just like gets into cars. This is crazy. This is nuts, I feel yeah. like we need to pause this because we're all. We, we? This yeah. is like should five we, we minutes. We've been this, yeah. steadily distracted. It's just distracted. consuming our. Yeah, it's, our it's definitely taking. I think away. we're concerned for our safety. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> nah, we're okay. This this warehouse is made out of metal. Stuff. metal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Aluminum. Oh no. Cement. Okay, I feel like we should take a break. Real quick. You think it's time for a break? Yes. All right, we're gonna take a break. <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna go handle this figure out this yeah. noise that's coming from outside. If Jason Statham's out there or not. Oh, I love Jason. Uh, Statham. We'll right Vin, Diesel, like, Vin Diesel. Wait, wait, how Vin do you, Diesel. Vin Diesel. Hold on, before we cut out, and he's like, "Hello, this is Jason Statham, and I'll kill you with my thumb." Hello, this is Jason. <laughs> that was a great impression. All right, bye bye. We'll talk to you yeah. later. <laughs> I think I know this song. I also know this song. You know this song? Who sings it? Do tell. <laughs> Mike, what song is this? This is, uh, this is Armageddon by Falling Short, Two T's. We need some more hype. You can find it. This is me, motherfuckers. <laughs> and for once, we could play a song without getting copyright strikes. Yeah, no. We're no. still going to get copyright. <laughs> <laughs> Mike comes after us. <laughs> he sues us. Oh my god! You're not gonna <laughs> sue us, are you? Hold on, can you can you give us permission right now so we don't get yeah, sued? Yeah, yeah, you're good. You can you can play this on every show. Wow. <laughs> Holy crap! Guys, we are in the presence of <laughs> That's a great. legend here. Yes. <laughs> in so, the making. So, what was your motivation behind that song? Um, so Armageddon is about um, it was in the midst of uh, Corona in the start of it, mm. and um, everyone was freaking out. Everyone's like. This is the end of the world. Like, everyone's going to die. And um, tagged on to that was um, a bunch of uh, other um, things that, like, um, I don't want to get into uh, the political <laughs> shit. <but>, um, <laughs> there's some political stuff. Yeah, there's some political <laughs> shit. There's, there's a, lot of, a lot of unrest, a lot of people... Going head on against each other, you know. There was no, um, there wasn't peace. There was no peace in the world. Mm. So, um, it felt like it was the end of the world. It felt like it was Armageddon. The world was ending. Wow. And um, you know, there's um, 
yeah, I mean, basically that's it. Like, um, it feels like the end of the world. There's a, uh, the breakdown of the song is, um, I'm saying, uh, there's no use in running, grab your guns and aim for their heads. Like you got to protect yourself at that point. Like it literally felt like, oh, wow. Second Amendment. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> like Second Amendment. So no, yeah. Let's go. It literally well, felt like, like you got to. <laughs> <laughs> there's no watching what you say anymore. It's no, you, you're saying what you're saying. And no matter what, someone's going to come at you. So mm. be ready to fire back. And, uh, wow. You know, be ready mm. to, um, to, to kill. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> Well, it was a pleasure <laughs> to have it played on the show. I just have one question. What's that? Mm-hmm. That camera's on, right? Yes. Okay. <laughs> I had a feeling. I don't remember. I didn't remember Stop going over the there. Camera too. <laughs> <laughs> so where were we, Ben? Uh, I mean, we were talking about ghost stories. Uh, I mean, I guess the the point of what uh, I was getting to was that the start was fake overall. My friends got me to believe that. Wait. Hmm? So this didn't happen? No, no, no. no. So, <laughs> well, so, it did so happen, but it didn't. There was you weren't cons- young. Oh, and I like, was I was young at some free? point. Yeah, I was I was I was wasting your youth at being <laughs> in a youthful situation. But uh, the 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 story is the whole thing was fake. There were about uh, two or three guys who thought that uh, us going into this like cellar would be a funny enough thing to trick Damn us. those kids. Yeah, yeah, you'd be like, oh, let's <laughs> pretend that there's ghosts involved or whatever. And they got a bunch of my friends to agree that uh, ghosts had been involved in this situation. And I, I don't know if I mentioned it before uh, we went out, but like. That night that I heard about the story, I was so horrified. I like, I slept with my uh, my yes. light, my yeah yeah my bedroom lights on, my hall light on, my door wide open. I was horrified. I was like, oh my god, there's a <laughs> legitimate <laughs> ghost that because is angry. Because ghosts can't yeah. get you if yeah, you yeah, have yeah. the light exactly. on. Exactly. Yeah, if the light, if, <laughs> or the light is, if you're yeah. under the blanket. Yeah. 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 You ever see that? Or you ever you see the TikToks? Run up the steps. No, no, no. It's such a, such a simple. <laughs> and they go you very slow up steps. You ever see the TikToks where like it starts off with like a whoever running with the lights on? Yeah. No, no, no. Yeah, with the lights on. And then they flip the switch and they're running even faster. And then the guy, the person, oh, you they have think to turn is, the lights off and then they race to their bedroom yeah. and put the covers. And the up person's over their chasing head, them, and as and soon as they get in their bed, <laughs> yeah, yeah, something it's like, like that. It's like someone in like a black so morgue. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> like, yeah, what are you saying about that? Oh, we need to tell them what we found outside because we like all got off here oh, in right, a rush right, right, and right. didn't even mention what. So happened. short went outside. What did you see? Nothing. <laughs> there's a there's a car meet across the street. And um, oh, that's it. <laughs> they don't. Let's refrain from using it's not any a real ethnic car words. meet. It's probably a bunch of like <laughs> Honda <laughs> Civics and stuff like that. It's fucking rough. But they're they're revving those engines. It sounds like Fast and Furious over there. Yeah, that was. Did you see really Jason Statham? Just... No, Jason Statham, oh, but Diesel? there was Someone Vin. Vin was, was there. He uh, was he was, he actually stopped a train with his fist. It was crazy. Groot was what? there? Stopped his... Stopped his <laughs> Groot was there. I am Groot. Andrew got so excited. Oh, you have the hiccups? I do. God, it's that's so No, worst. this is the worst possible I've time to have hiccups. I've been literally so long. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Quick, stop hiccups breathing. Too. It helps. Yeah. No, just kidding. Hang upside down. Drink water through a paper Drink towel. Drink water through a paper and towel and breathe. hold your breath. <laughs> that's real. <laughs> Drink water through a paper towel? Yeah. I've never heard that. Yeah. I've uh, heard drink water upside down. I've done it. I'm on this. I'm on this. <laughs> no! Oh, oh my that God, scared you the shit out of me. No. So See, that's bad. where you scared me. That's, 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 that's where you. Ben goes. That's where you freaked yeah, up. That's where you're mistaken. You done fucked up. <laughs> I, I, I don't fear conventional means of scaring. And so that is. Uh, I can really go for some sushi dude, right now. I swear. Sushi. I'm, oh, sushi. He's gonna. So <laughs> He's gonna pay right back. See you later, Ben. <laughs> Give him the Tito's. <laughs> Give him the Tito's. <laughs> what Tito's? There's no Tito's. <laughs> He's chugging water. Okay. Chugging the water. Tito Bovi? <laughs> Uncle Gross. Tito um, from Rocket no, Power. Ha ha ha, Rocket Power. Great show. Rocket Power? Awesome. Mm. Underrated. Excellent show. Underrated. Excellent show. Goddamn diaphragm acting up. <laughs> <laughs> um, they just don't make shows how they used to. No, they don't. No. I Cat mean, Dog? Cat Amazing. Dog. Cat Dog. Cat Dog. Cat Dog. Dog. Dude, However, I've heard some some weird things about that new Tom and Jerry movie. Really? really? I always I haven't love I haven't Tom seen it, but I've heard like some weird like one? I've seen some weird videos about it in general. <laughs> like, yeah, there's I'm a sorry. new one. We really? need to zoom in on Andrew. Just like, <laughs> he was like, "There's a new one." <laughs> like literally. Like, I guess it's the first one. Like, 
that's gonna be uh, that's gonna be an Andrew job. So that was a vision. So I don't know if you guys know or not, but the Qua Crew has a TikTok now. Follow us on TikTok at the Qua Crew. Andrew's in charge of all the content. So so if it sucks, blame. If there's only one video, make sure you uh, (laughs) spam the DMs for more comments. Spam the DMs so he uh, so he gets on it. I literally don't remember the last time I had the hiccups, and of course, I'm so sorry. Bro, fuck off. <laughs> yeah, so like, like, fuck you. Yeah, fuck it's oh. like, you should probably... Ah! No. It's not going to happen, dude. We needed to get a ghost. Yeah, we didn't Anthony have to debate about like, You can't yell oh, loudly. No. You try. No, and even your yells are like very... When I yell, my voice cracks. Yeah. It's really annoying. How are you, you can't yell? discipline your kids? You're just going to have to have... Hey! <laughs> <laughs> you're just going gonna... to have to have something that's like... Can you get off of there? <laughs> You guys! <laughs> this you is really unacceptable. Them, wait, 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 what movie okay. is that from? The Hey You Guys! Oh, Goonies! Yeah! Oh, my hey You oh, Guys! The, <laughs> the Truffle Shuffle, dude. Yeah. <laughs> the Truffle the Shuffle. Table. Dude, I can't believe I'm still like a big. That's hard. Let's get into Boston a little more. Oh. Yeah, you'll be um, Before we end the show. Boston. So, I don't know who's in, from Massachusetts or. <laughs> How, how that works, but I you am. are. We we, uh, we were in Weymouth, and Weymouth. Uh, we were in this Airbnb. It's like this this house that had like four different apartments in it. We searched we some huge, fucked like, up shit on that YouTube. Well, like Weymouth, our went our to one ghost apartment and abandoned houses, and now we're back in Weymouth. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's uh, it's a full circle. Full circle now. The flow yeah. of this. Is the circle. That that um, show on Netflix. Netflix. Yeah. that Airbnb that had a, a YouTube. Uh, it, was, it had a YouTube logged wrong. into it. <laughs> oh man, man, you got to go into that. We searched some. We even searched fucked up shit for for normal people. I at that uh, maybe we're normal. I don't know. <laughs> we searched normal shit for you know our liking. Maybe it's fucked up for other people. <laughs> But um, this is so bad. Probably, <laughs> I feel so bad for Ben. Oh, probably no, I can't control it. <laughs> for um, <laughs> for the person who owned the home and the YouTube account, it's definitely some fucked up shit. I thought he was gonna apologize. We are so no. sorry to the host of that Airbnb. Zao for the weird Netflix stuff we were watching, weird YouTube stuff we were watching. Rucka Rucka Ali. No. <laughs> <laughs> what is he saying? <laughs> yeah, no, we had a good time though. No, I'm not getting into that stuff, but um, I think we went to. If you know, you know. If you know, you know. We went through 42 beers, right? Yes, yes, 42 between, between the three of us, and a Jack Daniels and a um, 42 beers, Captain, Captain Morgan. Yeah. Did you have any Jack Daniels left? I, uh, we left we a little like bit a for bit. for the. Oh yeah, yeah, that's right. There was like a quarter <laughs> yeah, of one left in the fridge. I have one question about your Boston, and then we polished off the Captain. About the night you guys got really drunk. Did Garcia fall asleep in the bathroom? No, no, no. He fell asleep in his room a few times. Yeah, we we got drunk like, the whole time. I did like an Irish goodbye and just like went to my room and fell asleep. <laughs> yeah. The, basically the whole trip we were getting drunk because we only had work two so days. He's like walking off. He's the over there like. <laughs> he's, he's like pacing. <laughs> he's like, God oh, damn these hiccups. Oh, God, I haven't had the hiccups in years and this is the fucking time I get it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Holy shit. Perfect timing. Unbelievable. And it was a good time though. Unbelievable, uh, dude. We went to a my pet God. store. We did go to a pet store. Bro, there was some cool. Store. Didn't buy any pets. There was a lizard. There was a large lizard there. Very large. It was like a Cromoda dragon, bro. A Cromoda dragon. But it wasn't. <laughs> yeah, this was this was the only. Uh, oh my god! This was the only. Uh, uh, We're good. What's it called? Uh, a pet. St- <laughs> <laughs> this was the only pet store that I'd ever seen anyone selling an axolotl, which are those little lizards. They had yes. These? Oh, oh they were gosh. so cute. Wait, the they're oxalot. white and they have little like gills. It's like a lizard. fish. It's I a, got fish a video lizard. I got a video. Fish lizard. lizard. I can't believe this. I'm gonna show the camera. Pull it up. It's a pull lizard. it up. Oh, I can't pull it up on there. Pull Andrew up an Harry. axolot. I don't know how to spell Axolotl. it. Axolotl. <laughs> A-X-O-T-T-L-E. It's so cute. He's so cute. He was posing there it is. for me. He was posing. It was so cute. <laughs> this is an Axolotl. Oh, yeah. That is weird. <laughs> Look at those oh, cute yeah, there ass bastards. Look at him. <laughs> I have never seen a pet store that was willing to sell these things. <laughs> that is weird. Oh, my right? God. Yeah. What do they oh, eat? It was so what cute. Are they, what are they, I don't know. What is their purpose? It looks like they eat to rainbows. They're so cute. They eat rainbows. <laughs> uh, it, looks like, it looks like Garcia. It's a unicorn. Master fish. of Yo, wait. Are they masters of regeneration? Yeah, they can. Degeneration X. Can you cut off a limb and they will grow? Their back? amazing ability to true. regenerate oh, limbs, don't probably. Cut off their limbs. It looks like yeah. a Pokemon. It Pokemon. does kind of look like a Pokemon. 
Oh, is there a video? Oh. Not that we had a video. Oh, no. don't, don't show the ad. Don't, don't show the ad. Uh, Quackcrew.com slash shop. <laughs> the Quackcrew.com slash shop. Skip the end. Skip, 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 skip the end. Skip the end, Andrew. Skip it. Come on. Skip. You have headphones skip on. So you don't the end. How loud you're skip so it. <laughs> skip the end. Skip the end. Skip, skip the end. It. Okay, there we go. Yep. I uh, see this motherfucker. <laughs> There he is. Wow, look how cute he is. Those were the guys we were hanging with. <laughs> so cute. Look at that. I'm he so looks... disturbed. I can't even look at oh, the lizard. Lizard. So lizard fish. Yeah, I've never. Skip the air. Skip the air. <laughs> oh, look at him. Oh, oh she's yeah. got the same hair. Oh. She has the same hair. She yeah. is. As the axolot? She's an axolot. Yeah. She's an axolot. <laughs> yes. <laughs> axolotl. <laughs> Oh so yeah, we kind of just uh, you know. I can't believe I'm still fucking hiccuping. This hold your nice. breath, man. I what? You like I haven't hold talked. it more. <laughs> Suffocate. Okay, no one talk <laughs> until he's done holding his breath. <laughs> I lost the quiet game. Not working. Oh, is it working? Red. He's turning red. He's he's red. Am I? Oh. Oh. You had to ask him a question. No, he might pass out. Dude. Quiet yeah. coyote. We, uh, <laughs> Quiet coyote. We went to a pet store. Stop it. That's from Seoul. <laughs> it's in from like, mid, like kindergarten. Oh. Yeah, I, remember, I, remember I thought yeah. we were totally going to have a Quiet bonding coyote. moment and you were going to be like, yeah. Well, I, I love, love Seoul, that. though. Oh, I did. Too. I watched it like Such three times already. Movie. Me too. Yeah, Great oh. movie. Spiritual as hell. Oh, the best yes. part is when he's playing the piano. He plays it a lot. Snail. <laughs> 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 so yeah, we went to a pet store. Rude. Went to a liquor store that was previously busted through by a deer. Ransacked. And uh did two drive in movies. Wow. And did we, two and more, we did two drive bys. More importantly, we bonded. We Absolutely. bonded. I think we had a good time. We are now on a higher level. We met they a bonded. friend. We met two friends. Anthony. They bonded. They bonded. Yes. There was unification. <laughs> And mind and soul. Like Unify. We met this people. We met people. It was cool. Steve. Yeah. Steve the pirate. Shout out Steve, my buddy. The pirate. Who I've been talking to for no, a while. He's not a pirate. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, what is happening up in Steve's what was your got friend's a, name? Steve's got a accent. My friend, my friend. I keep name, forgetting her name. Her name was Noel. Noel. Shout out Noel. Shout out Noel. Shout out Steve. Curing um COVID. <laughs> yeah, the COVID she she, cure. She she's um ben, she good? works at Harvard. Ben's over there throwing up. <laughs> he's just like projectile vomiting. I haven't had hiccups in years, and of course this is the one time it fucking happens. <laughs> I can't control myself All right, from guys. fucking the hiccups. So fucking amen. We're gonna do what we did last episode. I like how that turned out. We're gonna do audio only for the next little bit. Uh, we have some more in, very interesting things to talk about. <laughs> so, Just like last time, right? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> sure. So, so if you guys want to so know what we talk about, tune in on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, or on the <laughs> no. dot com. We to post find our out my podcast mother's day. favorite cereal. Find out, <laughs> what is find out Liz's mother's made. So for those of you watching the episode, <laughs> for those of you watching the video version, thank you so much for tuning in. Me and my dad. That's Ben. Yeah, That's Mike, aka Falling Baby Short. Uh, we will see you guys next week. Yucky.